Okay, who is starving? Are you pooping instead of eating? Yeah, that is why. I just don't know if I was starving and I had to poop. Where's Where are they getting all the poop if they haven't eaten? Here's a question for you. Huh? Reel me that one. Hi, and welcome back to the Temporal Tear Challenge. This is Photon EM. And we are just beginning where we left off last time. I think I uploaded the last video four or five days ago, but for me it's been over two weeks, I think, since I played this map. Because I just had technical difficulties uploading and I didn't want to move on to making more videos until I straightened that out. Or recording more content, so... Here we are. Um, I uh, realized that this area was filling up with oxygen, so before I started today I just queued up this... Um, moving this oxygen diffuser and gave it a really high priority. Uh, other than that, the only thing I queued up this, which we can't even reach right now, but I'm going to have to find more mealwood seeds. Although I guess growing and harvesting mealwood will give me more mealwood seeds, but I'd rather just... I could dig up these wild ones, but why? There's a whole bunch of buried objects over here. I just want to get this insulated tile finished right here on the cool steam vent. So that is the dupe's number one priority. Um, I think I made it a six. Oops, that's the wrong thing. That's the wrong thing. Okay, like I said, it's been a while. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I gave all the tiles a six and the, the stairs, I guess, but the digs are a five so that they get any exposed tile before they dig something else out. And then, um, the only other thing that I did while it was paused is queue up these two ladders so we can go up here and explore this. I was waiting for them to deconstruct all this stuff first but I mean I decided that I don't care. Yeah so that's where we're at. Um, I might just... I'm not seeing any errors so I might just speed it up again. Oh well, let's get our research first. Okay. So I think the next thing is going to need to be some plumbing type stuff. So let's go ahead and queue that up. And we'll go up here and stick in a deodorizer or two. I wish it would bring up this overlay instead of the breathable air overlay. Where do I want it? Yeah, right here I guess. I don't know. There's a little bit too much overlap with this one. I'll just put that one more in between. So these things have a range of two. They go out, you know, one, two squares. So there's a little gaps, but it's fine the way the air flows around. It's fine. And new printables. Let's take a look. And then we'll look at that skill point. Okay, so... On this map, you don't want to be too picky. We just need people to help out. Hmm. Researching, suit wearing, tidying. Interior decorator, like I always say, is actually a negative. But this is a really good rocket dupe. And they can carry stuff for us until then. So. God damn it. Rocket dupe. Come on board. And skills, rocket dupe's gonna carry. And dig two is gonna dig harder. Dig harder than he's ever dug before. He's gonna dig super hard. That's how hard he's gonna dig. All right. Uh, that was fast. Holy smokes. So as you can see, we're still working on this. I'm hoping to get to some exploration today. But like I said, I also need to dig up all these buried objects. Should be able to do both. Okay, who is starving? Are you pooping instead of eating? Yeah, that is why. I just don't know if I was starving and I had to poop. Where's Where are they getting all the poop if they haven't eaten? Here's a question for you. Huh? Reel me that one. So, um, 
Yeah, my cat and I talk about pooping a lot because he's really into pooping. So I guess I'm kind of in the habit. Sorry. Oh, we got another skill point. I bet it's the other digger. Nope, I'm wrong. That's a reminder not to listen to me. Um, and then, you know, eventually I'm going to give this dupe a little bit of medicine. Um, oh, I did queue up something else. I'll, I'll show you that in a second. I just... Yeah. Over here I queued up some digging of buried objects because I'm not finding um, br any more briar, bluff briar. So I'm hoping maybe I'll find some um, buddy buds or something. Let's take a look. Oh, we got another skill point. Man, we are on fire to buy out. You know what that is? That's because I bought two points into carrying. And that's considered the top of that tree. Oh boy, we are going to dig so hard. There you go. All right. Anyway, maybe I'll find some buddy buds to put here. I have no decorative plants at all that I've found. Um, and I suppose, you know, some of these could be these other ones too. But we want to do some of this other stuff first. It's just nice if you can get their morale up and give them skills faster. Oh my goodness, my researcher is so good and so fast. Um, I think we want water filtration so we can deal with the lavatory water, so we'll go for that. And did I pick up um, thimbleweed? No, I haven't found any thimbleweed either, except for obviously this wild one. That might be something else that we find here. And then I queued these up because I'm going to bust this slime lung out and, and go down here. If nothing else, I'll get Paku fillets when these guys die, so. But we, obviously, we're going to want to explore. Because the temperature here isn't too high, we might even push the base to the right. Who knows? Um, how are we coming along? Okay. Now can we go super fast? Okay, what was that noise? I don't think it was a skill point. Okay, super fast. Super fast, I think I set it to five times speed. It might have been six. We'll have to keep an eye on the dupes because they get confused. See, we just got a mealwood seed there, so. Um, yeah. And I guess since I'm gonna bust into here anyway, we'll just pump the water from here into our new toilets. Ah, oh, that'll be so good. Oh my gosh, then they're gonna poop so fast and maybe they won't be as starving. That would be nice. Okay, so this I rated as a 4, because getting some decoration is not as important as this other stuff. Some exploring and stuff. Um, that's nice, we got the bioscan there. What's our achievement? Don't tease me like that. Okay, we automated a building. Oh, that's um, the smart battery on this coal down here which I am going to change to like 60 maybe. Um, and I tend to go to 98 just because I don't know, like, do they keep going for a split second and produce a little extra or I don't know. I don't know how these things work. I probably should since I'm making a video like this, but I don't. Okay, we recovered a database. That means we went in here and we found F all. F all is what we found in here. Let's see, are there wires we can get? There's a little copper that's not worth getting. Automation, no. Damn it. There we go. This game always makes me push the wrong button. Is that a snazzy suit? Ooh. Research one. You're gonna be pretty fancy. Yep. Okay, so we're already getting to priority four stuff. What does that mean for this area? Okay. So I didn't queue up these digs because I wanted to focus on what was exposed. And then I'll dig up these when they're done. Wow. I mean, just stop starving. We're obviously not starving, right? I wouldn't want to eat muckweed either, but you can eat it. 
So I let in that flatulent dupe and I built this oxygen too close and now um, it's looking better. At first the natural gas was down to the ladders, but now we've got three tiles of CO2 and that makes me feel a lot more comfortable. Ooh! Okay, this is looking really good. Alright, good job, dupes. Um, research, um, so I guess I'll get the tank. Let's take a look at this. I'm, we're gonna get hydroponic tiles so that if we find any thimbleweed we can grow it. Um, and we can just use our pea water. Okay, so now we have everything to make the bathrooms. Um, and we're almost done with this, so let's make the bathrooms. I was thinking to go in this way just so we don't spill in here, but I think I'll just go like this. That's fine. And we'll go like this. We need to get the floor in before we dig up most of the buried objects because look at the bottom of this. Sand, fertilizer, sand, fertilizer, dirt. All of those will break under water pressure. So I'm just gonna play it safe, even though it does take extra time. Okay, and I guess I can run the wire from below. And so that's what I'll do. I'm just kind of looking at what's gonna be the least amount of digging rather than uh, saving the decor which would probably be good to do also um, okay good we can dig out some of this at least I don't like digging this one out because it's gonna waste a little bit of water but whatever um, and then by doing this they will actually get this sand here so we can go like this I think Um, should be okay. And then I think I'm gonna need ladders for these ones up here, so we'll just do this number. Okay, printable. Hmm. Uncultured. See, uncultured is a wonderful one. Researching, it is nice to have two researchers towards the end, but I already have that astronaut person. But then they'll be in the rocket. This one I think I can use right now. Supplying, grease monkey, yeah yeah, so they can be a, um, another engineer. Okay, girl. Supplies, engineer. Yes. I'm very creative, in case you were wondering. I'm the most creative, the best brain. Okay, wow. Oh yeah, yeah. I was thinking still that I had researched the, um, the electrical one. Okay, so now we'll go for this. Okay, did I, I did find some mealwood seeds. I did not find briar seeds though. Gosh. And then over here, uh, I guess we'll go like this. Of course we could dig this, um, the wild plants that are growing but I just don't like for now they're giving us food so I think it's fine this one too okay um, wow this faster setting does go faster what do you know I don't think I'm really even prepared for it um, okay 
Also, let's get some plumbing going. So I'm just gonna build one at a time. Because that way... Um... And I'm gonna make sure these ones are actually working. Before I, um destroy some of the outhouse ones. And if you're wondering why I would do this on a playthrough where I'm trying to be speedy, the reason is that these take less time in the long run. Okay, I think what I'm gonna do is pause it because, oh no, this is why they're, they don't have anything to do because I didn't queue this up. She isn't stuck there, is she? What the hell? What's going on with Rocket Duke? Idle and hungry. Well, move to over here. Uh, I mean, she's maybe on her downtime. Oh, I didn't do downtime or priorities for my new people. Oh, yeah. Okay, so right now you're doing this. I guess, yeah. Um. And I don't think I even did skills for the newest new. Oops. I bet you were yelling at the screen. Were you yelling at the screen? And then, one thing about recording and editing your own playthroughs is you get to see your mistakes. So if we go back to I accidentally put this guy on don't attack rather than maximum attack which I noticed when I was editing, but I wanted to fix it, like, on screen, because I'm sure people were going, what? Hey, you said attack! Okay, now we need the filtration system. Lock. Lock. And the reason I put that there is so I could run the pipe through here and still have this be a room. Um, I guess I'll put, just put it here, what the heck. And... Um, where is it? Refinement, water sieve, and yeah, I slowed it down because it was like just beyond my ability. Um, you know what? I'd rather have it go out this way, and I get to do whatever I want. And I'm not going to block that because there's a mealwood seed down there. Okay. So, why do I want it up here? I guess when this is going, this is fine. This is enough water for three, I, I think. Um, or it will be. It will be by the time we get, um, what do you call it? Oh my gosh, I'm losing my mind, you guys. I can only do one thing at a time. I can either build or talk. Um, and it's going to be build. So let's get this queued. And we'll get uh, storage for some sand. And look at all that mealwood. And what do you know? We found two briar seeds. Yep. So have you guys messed around with spore kids? I have, and it's kind of fun. You feel like you're living dangerously. Um, why won't it let me click on anything? Oh yeah. Okay, so we'll build a couple more beds so that if we... Bring on more dupes, we'll be ready. And if we get up to 16, then I guess the door will go here. One, that's four. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Okay, so now I have it on the slow speed and it looks like people aren't doing anything. Uh, over here we want filtration medium, we haven't discovered Rayleth yet, so that's fine. And we'll go back to, like, a more normal speed. And yeah, I guess it turns out we can't handle super duper speed. So, I what I had in mind, so I was thinking about whether I could use this stuff for Natural Park, and what I had in mind is that maybe I put, like, th these are four plants right here, so I could 
cut it off right here and put Atmos suits on this side because we do need Atmos suits. Um, one of the problems I had with this playthrough, just testing it, is that I let too many dupes die. Oopsie. Um, and the reason was that um, they kept suffocating because I was skimping on Atmos suits trying to go fast. But it's actually quite a bit slower if they die. So um, this time we are just going to try not to let them die. So over here I'm kind of like torn about what to do. I guess if I'm planning to put Atmos suits here, we want the ladder up to go right here. Which would avoid a lot. There's obviously a lot of salt water over here. Holy crap. Um, let me just check on my algae. Okay. Um, and I did not, I found three thimble reeds. Oh yeah. We want to set up some thimble reeds here too. I forgot. Okay. How are things going? Ugh. Yeah, yeah, this is right. Okay. So we'll go ahead and deconstruct. Deconstruct. I'll get the thimble reeds in a second. I want to be ready for better bathrooms. Okay, um, I guess I am gonna block that mealwort in there. I just always feel like it's a tile, so it should be in the tile area. Okay, so if this overflows, it'll go into thimble reed production, and we'll just start with one. And we've got people bored, so we're gonna start exploring. Um, I think I'm gonna pause it and queue up some exploration. Okay, so first of all, I'm gonna go ahead and put in a carbon skimmer down here. Um, I'm gonna straighten out this area. So that we just have a little bit better transportation going on. Um, and then uh, I'm gonna have this, so we don't need to make it pretty, we don't need to make it work well, we need to just make it work enough. Um, so I'm just not worried about, you know, how these, oh, I guess to get to, one thing I do need to worry about is how we're gonna get to these pipes. So we'll dig that out. Um, so yeah, because it looks like, you know, we're starting to build up some CO2. I could put in algae terrariums, but they're just too much, um, too much labor. And also I could put another sieve, sieve down here, uh, but that would be too much labor because they have to go and refill it. Although eventually I can put sweepers. So over here, you know, this is pretty straightforward. I queued up sedimentary rock because we're not doing hatches, so it, it doesn't matter. Um, I probably should get some bleach stone storage though, because it's just annoying to have all that bleach stone leak into the base. It'd be nice to put it, to just put it over here. Let's do that. Oh, yeah, that gets us to some fossil anyway. Let's do that. Nice. Okay, why do they not want to do this? Oh, that's okay. This is important too. Yeah, just checking to make sure the only way out they can't go out this way. They have to go out through here, so they have to wash their hands. And I do not have polluted water storage. And the reason for that is that we might as well just have them off gas. The, the polluted air doesn't matter unless you have slime lung, although we can go ahead and clean it. So, yeah. So we'll just let it sit there stink up the place. Okay, so now they've got these pipes built for me. Um, so we'll get our handy pliers tool and we'll hook this up. What did I do? Oh my gosh, I queued up the 
this and forgot to delete it. Oops. Okay. That's good. So, at first this will be a little bit bad because we're going to need a lot more water in the system. Hmm. Yeah, no, it's already bad. Hold on, I had to make another change here. So what we'll do like that. And if there's overflow in this direction, it'll go here. Oh my gosh, what did I do? That wasn't very well thought through. But whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, Jennifer. I'm getting a little overzealous here. Okay. So the water to the electrolyzer will go this way. And I need a bridge. Okay, I've got it paused because... Ugh. So if it, if it backs up to the toilets, then we'll send it to... Maybe I should leave that for now in case I need to put more water in the system. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. Oops. Let's uh, deconstruct this, though. Okay, yeah. So we'll let it back up. This is the... This is an important one, so let's upgrade that one. So this is the polluted water coming out of the skimmer, which can't come out right now because I went deconstruction crazy. And then here, I gotta make sure the right thing is selected. Liquid pipe. Okay, good. Okay, it is going to work. That is better. Yes. And we got research done, conveyor, okay. And we got a new achievement, and we got printables, and man. It's an exciting place around here. Okay, Rust Royal Flush. Okay, so now we have some real, you know, more like, um, stuff that we probably don't need right this minute. But we might as well start researching, I guess. So I'll go ahead and, am I going to need these? Mm, maybe not. So we'll just go with, um, this one. So we can have an electrolyzer eventually. And that can be thimble reed. And then... Let's see, eight dupes on these settings require 40 meal wood, which we obviously don't have. So, I mean, I'm gonna put in um, probably put in lettuce, but I just don't know yet. Let's do this too so that they go a little faster. Oh, since they're going out there, we might as well put in our nature reserve right now. Ah, especially since I researched hydroponics. Why didn't that work? Was somebody standing there or something? What? What's the dealio? Okay, here's our lovely nature reserve. And if we go down to furniture... Uh, sandstone? Sure. Whatever. It's fine. And we might as well, I'm fine with just leaving that open. World's fastest researcher researches. Let's go ahead and do fossil fuels, and I'll go all the way to here, just like I said, in case I miss it again. I'm not right on top of it. And our calories are going down, so I might need to wait, even though I got an operator here. So I'm going to wait... Maybe I'll just reject. Oh, why is it so hard? Um, I'm gonna wait. I mean, this one's okay. It's not really what we need right now. You need more builders. Okay, I'm gonna reject. So the more dupes you have on this style of playthrough, the better. So um, I'm pretty squeamish about 
just rejecting them. And here we'll put Bleachstone. And um, I'm just going to make it like kind of a higher priority. I don't mind if a little chlorine gets into our base, but we don't need a ton of it. It's only 32-ish over here, so I'm not too worried about the temperature leaking in. I'm not worried about the hydrogen leaking in, but the chlorine makes a mess at the bottom of the base. Um, which we, you know, already have, so... I'm just wondering, um, I might put some... Yeah, I'm gonna put some automation on this so it doesn't... Uh, I guess it's okay. Um, it'll overheat itself if it eats up all the atmosphere. But I guess there's some hydrogen and natural gas down here. So hopefully it'll be alright. We'll go ahead and dig this out. This is where we're gonna put food prep if we do make bristle blossoms. And I'm gonna at least disconnect this. Okay, this looks fine now. So um I'll leave this pipe in so that if we need to use the pump, we can. But we'll go ahead and get rid of the uh whatever that was. Just the stuff in the bathroom. Okay, good. And now I guess um, this isn't enough for two people. Oh, we'll run, we'll run some oxygen out here. So this is going to be a project. And yeah, it looks like we have a ton of copper. And we don't have to worry about it. So I am not going to worry about it. Running the wire right through the bedroom isn't the most wonderful thing. Okay, wait. I just, I don't want, I paused it because I don't want him to start building it. Well, it's wrong. We can run it this way. Pretty sure I can reach all of this. Okay. So I didn't worry about the pipe, because pipes do not give negative decor. Decor, zero. But wires... Uh, let's look at it when it's built. Decor minus 4.5. So we'll just try to minimize it. Um, but yeah, this will make them work a little faster. And then when they get down here a ways, we'll put in another one further down. And I am not going to worry about the load on the wire. And skills, looks like I missed one. So we'll give um, research one carrying, and we'll then either, I don't know which one we'll do. They're already, Ugh. what I meant to say is, they're obviously working fast enough, so I'm not worried about that. Yep, okay. What did we get? See, research complete, just as I was saying that. Fossil fuels. There's something we don't need right now. So we have a lot of ore, uh, of coal. Most of this is coal. 32 and a half tons. So, yeah. They don't like to refill this, but... You know, we don't have to do it at 50%. Let's do 30. But let's make it a high priority. And, yeah. Okay, good. Looking good. Everything's coming up roses. Oh, let's, um... Oh, there's an angry guy. Hey, angry buddy. I guess, I don't know, this will probably break open. Um, what I want to do is set all of the lettuce. Oh, I already did. Well, do I have to undo that pinch of pepper now? Because you know what, pinch of pepper, nobody cares about you. And in the old days, they were like, so they'd preserve all the pinch of pepper on the map, and... <laughs> um, I mean, I guess I I do try to um, preserve a little bit more pinch of pepper when I'm playing on a regular playthrough. Oh, these are flooded. 
I guess we'll do do the bottom one instead. And oh, I've already got them set. Um, it's like I'm the same person every time I play. Okay, good. So we'll get a little lettuce coming in. Lettuce, unlike Rob, br bleh, bristle blossom. Um, lettuce gives you a uh, higher food quality because we have a little bit of bristle blossom coming in from our wild plants, the ones that get light. Um, and yeah, I could put in a light bulb over here, but uh, I don't know. Now that I say it out loud, I want to do it. It's not important. So, okay, so this is a problem anyway. All this water is going to make it really hard. Once we get down here, it'll pour out. It's going to make it slow because even if we have oxygen close by, they're going to be dying. And if I open this up, which it'll probably break, it'll just make it worse in the long run as we get down here. Okay. Oh, and then also I forgot about this, but there is another vent over here. When this goes dormant, we'll, we'll pop in there, but for now, we won't. But we'll come down here and look at this. I think it's a vent, because look at the shape of it. I'm not gonna... Oh, yeah, I mean... I'm sure that's gotta be a vent, but um, I'm not gonna cheat. I'm gonna dig down here, and I'm gonna dig out that one tile and see what it is. And let's just... Everybody say it with me. Cool steam vent! Cool steam vent! Cool steam vent! Here's hoping. You know what? Maybe I should wait. I'm gonna wait to go up until we get this water out of the way, because that's just gonna dump more water. Once we get to here, then I'll dump all of this water at least. Um... Okay, yeah, so did we find any more geysers? Here's the natural gas I was saying. Um, no, that's just a vacuum. We'll find that out soon enough. This was just a carbon dioxide geyser, so we always wanted. Um, this is chlorine. So, no. Okay, what are we going to research now, everybody? I'm leaning towards... Um, doing this one so we get the better transformers. Um, well, maybe we should do smelting first. And we'll, we can just do it like this so that we're going to need those things anyway. I did not mean... Okay. Here's my beef with this game. One of them. I love this game. It's maybe my favorite game, but it's definitely one of my favorites. On some screens, mouse wheel up and down goes up and down, or left to right. And on other screens, it zooms in and out. And it's really frustrating. So anyway, that's beef number one. I'll go on another soapbox, I'm sure, some other time. Um, okay, the tank is something I can use earlier. And I have to research this anyway for the space stuff, so we'll just do that. Because I don't need the refinery right this second, I guess. I don't know. I, I want to just focus on exploration right now. Did I even research something I could use? No. Oh, oh well. Although, speaking of, I want to go down sooner than I want to go up. Because we need to get petroleum going. And getting to the top of the map really quick isn't as important. I mean... Obviously, doing everything really quick, given the challenge, is important, but um, getting to the top of the map right away won't do us as much good. Because um, we'll research all the planets long before we are able to make liquid hydrogen, so, or research all the way to the temporal terror, anyway. We don't have to research all the planets. And speaking of that same thing, 
Um, in this playthrough, if we don't get Fullerene in the first two rings, I don't know if we can complete the challenge. For sure, if we don't get it in the third ring, we can't. We can't. I'm thinking about the first two rings. Uh, yeah, I, I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't think so. I mean, you can like eventually make liquid oxygen with... Um, I don't know what what are they I don't even remember what they're called because nobody ever uses them. These things that cool down gas, I think. You can eventually cycle it enough times that you can do it. But um it, it would be way too slow for our playthrough, so okay. Um Okay, so everybody's idle because the only thing I want them to do is this. I'm gonna pause again and oh. Actually, here's something I want them to do. I am going to pause again and just look and see what else needs to be queued up, because this is going to be slow. Okay, so uh, we got the meal wood, which you already saw. I queued up a ladder over here, because um, as I was saying, it would give us access at least to the Paku, whether I breed them or not, which I'm really not feeling getting a rancher right now. Um... But there are some more buried objects down there, too. Uh, okay, doctoring and operating. We just said we don't need that, but they're a grease monkey, so their operating's a little better. Um, decorating is nice to have eventually, but that's okay. Twinkle toes is, is nice. No taste is nice. But digging, well, digging is nice. I'm leaning towards our doctor operator here because um, uh, I'm not sure how much... Oh, this one has decorating too. Yeah, I mean, I've already got like three suppliers. Oops. I think um, I've got stinky operator and I don't know, research operator or something. I've got... But... So this would be like number three. Um, yeah. Okay. Priorities. I doubt I even did the last one. Oh, I did do. Okay. So I always put building for them because um, they have to build the, you know, the automation stuff. And oops, I tried to click on the skill point thing. Okay. Operating. And rocket dupe, we'll just keep, oh, you know, I probably should have done this because it helps them learn faster, but that's fine. That's fine. It's fine. I don't care. I'm just fine with it. Leave me alone. Okay, so yeah, as I was saying, probably rather boringly, but um, I'm just getting these, again, buried objects because I want more flowers, but uh, this will give us access to the Paku. We can plant mushrooms too, which is one way to use up our, um, what do you call it? Slime? Don't have a lot of slime right now, but. Um, and then I'm building a cooking station so that when we get a cook, we can make barbecue and cook fish. And if I recall, I'm researching stuff I no longer need. Okay, so let's put one of these. I don't want it powered. Put it somewhere that doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, that's floor level. Okay. And then I don't need to dig that. And we'll put it to Sweep only everything. And that way I can clear out places like this and cover them up with another hydroponic tile. Although it doesn't seem to be needed. It looks like we're not really overflowing. Because I don't have very many dupes, but we're using it a little bit. That's a nice little um, natural gas catch too. Maybe I should rethink. And, oh yeah, this is a hydrogen, hydrogen vent. So 
Oh, hey, saltwater geyser. Good, because I was worried about running out of salt water. Um, I was like, where am I going to get enough salt water? Um, and speaking of that, oh, one more thing. Well, let me just talk about the salt water. So we will use this for refining metal. And I haven't decided if I'll use the one down here or up top or over here on the left. Um, but yeah, that's what we'll just run all that through a metal refinery. So we don't even want this because it's too hot to use for that. And it'll probably heat up the water around it. So that leans towards um, the top of the map. Okay, so over here I swept up this water so that we can continue exploring out this way. And we'll pick up some of this buried object as well. What the heck? I'm addicted to this stuff. I don't know if that'll be diggable. Maybe if we get an angle on it? I don't know if it matters. I don't know if it's diggable. There's so much I don't know. Okay, and I can already see I don't want to just power through here. Wow. Um, I mean, I knew this was here, but this is all very saturated. Um, and we've got all kinds of buried objects over here, too. Fun times. Good stuff. And I queued this one up, which I thought, oh, they can't reach it because of this. Right. That'll get them across. Not, I'm not, like, real worried about it. It's just fun. It adds a little bit of fun to the playthrough. And if you can add a little bit of fun to a game that's already amazingly fun, I recommend it. Okay, idle. Why do we have four idle? Okay, I have a habit of pausing when people are idle so I can put them to work but I know pausing makes for a really boring watch um, uh, okay how are we doing okay so we dumped out that stuff under the ladder so now we'll go ahead and dig upwards and at least dump out this stuff this one uh, yeah what the heck we'll just keep going Um, I could offset the ladders, I guess. We could go down over here. That'd be interesting. Okay, let's do that. Um, let's see. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's make these higher so that I can then dig across here. Hmm. Okay. It seemed like a good idea, but I'm having trouble engineering it. All this is going to dump out, so look at this. This is like a crazy cavern here. I just want to go over there anyway. Okay, so we'll go like that. Dump this to the right. That should work. And then, then we'll continue from there. Yeah, okay. Um, how are we doing on time? Okay, I think it's about time. Um, we've done 12 cycles, or 12 and a half. And um, what did we just research? Oh, the liquid pipe demo. Okay. And so um, I think we'll cut out here. And um, we did get a little bit of exploration in here. I honestly don't see caverns like this that much in this game, so it's kind of cool looking. Um, we'll just take a last look at everything that we did explore, which looks like it's pretty cool. We can't get over there to that, because I did not do things right. I might as well just get my little bit of fun digging that up. Um, so anyway, yes, thank you so much for tuning in, and I hope that the microphone problems were fixed, and uh, I will see you in the next one.